Lawmakers in the natural state are cracking down on distracted driving laws. NBC 10's Gabrielle Pfeiffer reports on the new law that's set to make changes on the roadways. You see it all the time. I ran into the lady. She had her phone up, texted and driving. And you may even be guilty of doing it yourself. But a new law is now redefining the definition of texting. I think it's a good thing. Texting now includes any form of social media engagement and electronic text retrieval. It's running rampant right now. It's in high use uh, from all the access that's on our cell phone. The law is also cracking down on young drivers. Teens under the age of 18 can't use a cell phone or a hands-free device at all while operating a vehicle. Your objective is to pay attention to your surroundings. So if I'm on a hands-free device and we're talking about an issue, my mind is focused focused on whatever issue that we're talking about. And if you're in a construction zone while workers are present or in a school zone during school hours, all drivers, no matter the age, are prohibited from using a cell phone. You have the minimum speed limit and you have these laws. It's extremely important to pay attention to what's going on there. So you've got to keep it under the speed limit. And you. It's, it's going to be a, it's a primary offense. The only time it is acceptable to use your cell phone for any reason is when there is an emergency. Reporting in El Dorado, Gabrielle Pfeiffer, NBC10, your local news leader. Fines for a first offense can range from $25 to $250. A second offense will cost $50 to $500. And if the driver is in an accident or collision, the fines will be doubled.